Hey LEGO fans and welcome back to MB Bricks. Today I've got a super exciting purchase that I'm going to unbox for you. Um, I've been waiting because this was actually back ordered, the big one, the really exciting one. Um, so I did have to wait a little bit longer for this to come in, but they do kind of go together. Um, so I wanted to wait and do this for you on camera because I am super excited for this. Uh, so let's just dive right in and see what we got. Let's see, okay, let's we'll upside down. Get rid of the paperwork. And as I figured, it's a much smaller box than this huge one. So let's get rid of this. lot easier if I just started the video like this, but that's okay. <laughs> just more unboxing to do. Okay. I don't know if you guys have ever worked with this Lego product before. It is super cool. I just took a quick class on it, and um, I'm actually pretty psyched that they have this available on the Lego website. Da, 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 da. The Spike Prime Education Kit. So this is the big one. I will link it uh, below in the description if you want to link straight to the LEGO website for this Spike Prime box. And uh, it does come with the hub as well as a bunch of motors and things to go with it. So I'm just going to be surrounded by boxes. Oh, let's put this one down here. And, uh, hmm. let's just, just, just open this up and take a look because, oh, oh. Mm. I feel like this is not going to go well for my fingers, so let's see if I can slide this up. Otherwise, I'm going to go have to go get some scissors because this is really tight. Uh. That's not working either. No one is ever going to steal this. Let me tell you. I gotta go grab some scissors. I'll be right back. Dun, 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 dun. All right, I got some scissors. <laughs> that was so much easier. Next time, I'll bring scissors to all of my unboxings. All right. This is so cool. You guys have no idea how excited I was to find out <laughs> that this was on the LEGO website. So it does come with all of these parts, so you can get started. This is, so if you guys don't know, by the way, what the Spike Prime is, it's essentially their remake of the Mindstorms from the 90s, which is pretty much you can do a whole bunch of different robotic type things. And it's really, really useful and for myself in building um, mocks and stuff like that. And then you can add a bunch of different cool movements and that sort of thing. They did have a few other ones like the Powered Up and uh, I can't remember the, other, the name of the other one, but uh, this Spike Prime is definitely the coolest out of the bunch. It's Bluetooth operated with a rechargeable battery. So here you go, there's the unit there. And it has three ports on each side. So you can have a total of six things running at once that you can program right into the spike. And then there's the battery pack. This goes on like that, nice and easy. So you can charge that up. And then it does come with several other um, attachments. I'm trying to remember what each of them does, but one of them comes with um, a color sensor. So if it's going up to say red or blue or yellow, it will actually change speeds. And then there is also 
I think a sensor that uh, detects how close it is to an object. So if you've got your little robot going along and it detects that it's coming up to a wall, it will actually turn around and start going in another direction, which is like super cool. We've got one of these small motors there. And I think these are lights actually. These are one of the things that I actually didn't get a chance to play around with, but I did see them in the app, so I will be checking that out. And like I said, if you guys want tutorials on any of this stuff, just let me know. Because I'm going to be figuring it out anyways, and I'm more than happy to share <laughs> my limited wealth of knowledge at this point, but as I learn, so can you. Okay, and then there's another motor, so you've got two of the smaller motors, and then there's another one. I do believe this last one is a large motor. Yeah, so you can see the difference in sizes there, which is super, super neat. Um, and then it does just come with a bunch of Technic bits so that you can start creating. These are really cool, actually. These Technic grids, and then these really, really large Technic frames. Yeah, it definitely comes with a whole bunch of cool stuff in here, guys. Um, so, I definitely recommend if you want to start getting into um, any sort of robotics uh, that you take a look at this set. Like I said again, I will leave a link in the description below um, so that you can take a look at that. I'm going to put everything in here very carefully. And it even comes with two, two storage trays. So, I mean, super cool and useful. Who doesn't use sorting trays? Okay, so without forgetting that we do have one more smaller box here. Let's get this one open. This one came right away and I just had to wait for the larger one. But you can't really use these without that. Well, I'm hoping that you can use them. So these are actually um, the powered up lights. I don't know if you can see in this bag. I do have scissors if I can't rip it open. Don't worry, I got this one. So these are actually the lights that come with, I think it's the Powered Up, the most recent prior to the Spike Prime. So, where did I put that hook now? I'm hoping these will actually work together. They do fit into the ports okay. So there is a chance. Um, so like I said, I'm gonna play around with it, but I did wanna get some of these lights to go with them. And you can get up to five on the Lego website per order. So I did get five because there are six ports in here so that allows me to have six sets or five sets of lights and then still have another one for a motor if i want to have some sort of motion or any kind of combination and then i did get a couple of system motors as well just because those technic motors um you can integrate them into the standard uh, brick system but this is just easier so again, I'm hoping, even though they are part of the <laughs> powered up, let's see. Okay, so that does go into the spike hub as well. So these are the system motors that are the brick system instead of the Technic. So I got two of those as well. Um, so hopefully these can all connect together with the spike hub. I will be playing around with it and then I will make another video for you guys um, just to see if that does go together. And of course I did get this freebie of the, uh, what is it called? The Galileo, the tribute to 
the tribute of. <laughs> so that's always a good thing, getting free, free stuff. But obviously this was the main part of this order, the Spike Prime. And uh, yeah, if there's any tutorials that you guys want me to do for this, just let me know below and I'll play around with it a little bit and then I can let you know. But that does it for this unboxing today. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's a little bit different than what I normally make, but I was just so excited to get these out and show you guys what I got because I am going to be integrating these into my builds as much as possible if I figure out how to use them properly. But uh, anyways, do not forget to hit that subscribe button below so that you can stay updated when I put out some more videos on the Spike Prime. And until that time, keep on building.